Hey y'all, so let's get started. What messages were God have for the Corinthians? Messages for the Corinthians. Judgment in reverse. I'm gonna make a made a bad decision. Judgment in reverse is not a good decision. Or someone choosing to stay asleep, turning off the alarm clock. Judgment came out in reverse. So we have the four of cups here. Someone made a wrong decision. I feel like there's some discontentment because of that. We have six of wands here. Um, I do feel like some okay, someone could be missing an opportunity moving forward here. Ten cups here. Um an opportunity for happiness, an opportunity for emotional balance, emotional reciprocity. That's the opportunity. Um, Queen of Pentacles here. I feel like for a lot of you guys, this could be this could be the opportunity, or this could be you. Moon card here. In the dark about some things, judgment, moon card. Somebody's still asleep. Somebody's still asleep. Somebody doesn't see. An opportunity here. Ace of Cups, it's here though. Someone doesn't see an opportunity here. This is almost the same as yesterday. Page of Swords in reverse, but I feel like it's the feminine energy here that doesn't see an opportunity here. Three of Swords here, being delayed by their own heartache, being delayed by their own betrayal. Uh, maybe they feel like they betrayed themselves by not looking into something. Maybe they feel like um, they betrayed themselves by being delayed. Six cups here in the past. So we got the Knight of Cups underneath here. I feel like there could be some sort of proposal coming in. Ah, somebody might not see it. Judgment in reverse. Um, somebody might not see it. Someone may not see something as an opportunity. Um, the judgment in reverse, like I said previously, is a bad judgment call. It's a bad decision. Um, someone needing to make a decision. Four of Cups here, someone's stuck emotionally, and this is not the Six of Wands, this is the Five of Wands. So someone's in conflict either with their family or in conflict with themselves about what's going to make them happy. I feel like maybe someone's heartbroken by something they saw. Page of Swords here with the Three of Swords. Someone's heartbroken by something they saw. Maybe something dealing with a past relationship, maybe something dealing with someone from the past. Heartbroken by some something they saw. Moon card here. Ace of Cups. I feel like there's an opportunity here, but someone is in their feelings. Queen of Pentacles here is in her feelings. Okay, so we got Scorpio energy here. We have Cancer, in, Cancer, Cancerian energy here. And Queen of Pentacles, which is Earth sign energy, as far as Capricorn and Virgo. So we have Judgment in reverse. We got the King of Pentacles here. And the Eight of Wands. So someone made a bad decision by not either not communicating here with their counterpart, Will of Fortune here, creating some sort of change. There's been a lack of communication. Maybe uh, someone could have made a bad decision by walking away from someone. So someone could have made a bad decision by walking away from someone, um, going no contact, blocking any further communication. Four of Cups here. Or someone could have... This, I don't even think this is a decision because judgment in reverse. And I feel like with that eight of wands, it's just like someone didn't move forward. Someone didn't wake up to something. So four of cups here. We have knight of pentacles in reverse. I feel like someone missed an opportunity because it took too long. Knight of pentacles in reverse. I feel like there was some conflict dealing with family here. Um, someone was in their feelings or someone could be in their feelings about someone new. Ace of cups or about a new opportunity here. Um, I feel like whatever was, so for some of you guys, you may have missed an opportunity. I don't think you missed an opportunity because there's still an opportunity here. So you haven't missed an opportunity. I feel like there's just some conflict here. Five of, uh, wands here. Why is this five of wands here? I keep saying missed an opportunity, but I don't think you missed it. For some of y'all, Nine of Pentacles, y'all chose not to accept an opportunity here. Nine of Wands with the Eight of Pentacles here, finding the strength to overcome investing in drama, overcome investing in conflict. So some of you guys, I feel like, yes, right now you're unhappy. Um, there's a decision that needs to be made. Somebody needs to wake up and move forward here. King of Pentacles here. So Queen of Pentacles, King of Pentacles. Some of you guys may... Um, 
This is about a relationship. Some of you guys may be feeling as though someone needs to take some sort because the eight of wands is in reverse and that's like going back. So some of you guys could have made a wrong decision going back to someone or you could realize that it's a wrong decision to go back to someone. Um, I feel like with the four of cups and the Knight of pentacles, some of you guys are unhappy because something is at a standstill. Something was at a standstill. Something stopped. That stopped energy. Five of wands here being in conflict, trying to overcome that conflict. Some of you guys are trying to win some sort of investment. It's like outstrengthening the competition. Some of you guys are, are either you're winning. For some of you guys, you could be winning. There could be conflict here. Um... But some of you guys are winning because you're doing the work. So there's, I feel like this King of Pentacles needs to wake up because Eight of Wands in reverse, this King of Pentacles came out not moving forward. No, not moving forward. So I feel like a decision needs to be made. Somebody made, made a bad decision call or made a bad, a bad decision, made a bad call. And someone's unhappy because something stopped. There's there's nothing here. So now there's this conflict or there was this conflict and someone overcame the conflict and began working. And I feel like working on either their foundation or working on themselves. Ten cups here. Why is it ten cups here? This definitely has to do with the relationship. Ten cups here. Chariot here. Someone chose not to go toward a relationship. There's no victory within a relationship. This is dealing with a family situation. So there's no victory dealing with a relationship. Someone has healed. So where someone was once emotionally committed to something, someone has healed because of a bad judgment call. Someone is unhappy. Someone was unhappy with the such situation because of a bad judgment call. There may have been some conflicts surrounding it, conflict dealing with family, conflict dealing with um, emotions. But this is like the end of that. So this is the end of a bad judgment call. Queen of Pentacles here. Why is this Queen of Pentacles here? Why is this Queen of Pentacles here? King of Swords in reverse. Someone didn't see clearly in regards to this Queen of Pentacles here. So, <laughs> Five of Swords here made an unwise decision. Someone made an unwise decision. And I feel like with the King of Swords in reverse, there could be some, there could have been some lying, could even currently be some lying, some manipulation. Um, someone here could be defeated in some way, shape, or form, especially if they don't speak truth or especially if they have not spoken truth. Moon card here. Why is this moon card here? Why is this moon card here? Queen of Cups here. Five of Swords. Yeah, so someone here, either someone kept this Queen of Cups a secret or someone kept um, a secret how they feel. And that made some, 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 un, there was an unwise choice to keep secret about how you feel. So now there's an opportunity on the table. Um, page of swords in reverse is not good news. Um, it could be coming up out of delay, but it's not good news because three of swords here, someone may decide to sever some sort of connection, um, or either walk away from the past. Why is this ace of cups here? There's seven of cups here. Maybe someone in the past judgment here. Someone's choosing another cup. I told you there's another opportunity here. There's another cup here. Five of Wands here, and that could create some conflict. So someone's choosing another cup. There's conflict because someone's choosing another cup, choosing another opportunity here. Someone made a bad decision, a bad judgment. I got King and Queen of Pentacles out here, so it could be feminine or masculine. Um, I thought for sure that it was the Queen of Pentacles, but the judgment, the bad decision in reverse, may be the Queen of Pentacles deciding not to move forward with this King of Pentacles. It may be a bad judgment call, um, but with the Knight of Pentacles here in the Four of Cups, I feel like it's within good reason. Someone's unhappy that something stopped or something took too long. So now the conflict here is to overcome this energy, overcome the inner conflict and work on themselves. I feel like with the Ten of, of Cups here in the Chariot in Reverse, this is someone not having victory within a family situation or not having victory within some sort of emotional commitment. Queen of Pentacles here and the King of Swords here. I feel like this Queen of Pentacles could be lying here. This Queen of Pentacles could be lying about her feelings, um, needing to nurture herself, needing to open up herself. Ace of Cups here in Judgment. There's a decision that needs to be made about a new opportunity here. 
So maybe in the past, this Queen of Pentacles made a bad judgment call by staying. Yeah, Four of Cups here, Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Eight of Wands, that's not moving forward. By staying with this King of Pentacles here. Not having victory within the emotional connection. So this was a commo emotional connection and it had a lot of conflict here. And someone found the strength to overcome that by working on themselves. So I now feel like now this Queen of Swords is not seeing things clearly. That's okay. So there's a new opportunity here. And this Queen of Swords might be fearful of this. I mean, this Queen of Pentacles might be fearful of this new opportunity because of a bad judgment call in the past. This person needs to stop delaying and sever these past emotions so that they can move forward toward this new opportunity here. There could be a lot of confusion around this new opportunity as well. So why is this Page of Swords here? Five of Wands here. The delay was conflict and universe here. It's over. The conflict is over because nine of wands up here with the eight of pentacles and this five of wands. Let me, let me. And it's mind you, this page of wands. I mean, this page of swords in reverse is right underneath. It's literally like this. So the delay has been the five of wands, but you found the strength to overcome that and really start to build for yourself. Start to work on rebuilding yourself, rebuilding either yourself or rebuilding your life. Okay. So I do feel like the delay was the five of ones. It could also be like what's challenging this situation, but the universe is under here. So you've successfully completed this cycle. I feel like now you're not making the right decisions or not making the right judgments in regards to your emotions or in regards to nurturing your emotions based off of the heartache from the past. Cause we literally have heartache here and then the past. So three of swords here. Why is this three of swords here? Some of you guys need to sever past emotions so that you can make better decisions now. We got death here. What I'm trying to tell you. Put an end to the heartbreak. Some of you guys are, this is like bitter. You're holding on to this heartbreak. You're holding on to this betrayal. And even though you have a new opportunity here, page of cups here, you're not accepting the new opportunity. You could be rejecting a new opportunity because of past hurts, whether the past hurts come from this person or someone new. Because I got two kings out here. I got two kings out here, two queens out here. So this masculine or feminine, this could be a man that's making the wrong decision, um, turning down an opportunity because he's basing it off past hurts. This can be a woman that's doing the same thing. I don't know if they're doing it together or they're doing, you know, they have separate connections. Don't know. So six of cups here. We got the four of wands here. So I feel like for a lot of you guys, there was a lot of plans made in the past. I feel like for some of you guys, you're dealing with a past, past heartache. Five of Cups here. So I feel like you've been now just trying to perfect your energy, protect your energy, perfect your energy moving forward here because of the regrets that you have of the past. So some of you guys could be creating conflict within a new relationship, within something that could bring emotional victory because of not seeing things clearly. Maybe even because you could even be lying about the way that you feel um, making a decision, or not a good decision, but making a decision around a relationship to kind of put it at a pause. Some of you guys could be blocking yourself from possibly 10 cups here because of three swords, six cups, past heartbreak, past betrayals, past hurts. You got to let the past go. All right. So let's see what guidance we have for the collective. Life cycles, life cycles popped up. So some of you guys, you're creating a cycle around. It looks like your your emotions because you're afraid. You're afraid. Some of you guys are afraid to see clearly what it is that you feel. We got life cycles. It doesn't feel fair and it isn't always fun. Yet this is what we signed up for to experience this roller coaster we call life. The ups and downs, trials and tribulations. It's all for a purpose greater than us. Just embrace it. So yesterday we did we did the reading and it came out that there's a perfect match. Okay, we got that. But I definitely feel like this is an extension to that because I still have a perfect match here, but I also have two people that are not being they're not communicating. King of Swords in reverse is shutting down communication. Eight of Wands in reverse is shutting down communication. So you have two people here that are not communicating. And I feel like it's because with both of them, 
needing to put an end to past hurts. You could have made a lot of plans with someone of the past. You could have even had some sort of uh, promises of the past, but there's this feeling of betrayal that is crawling over into a new opportunity here. There's a decision that needs to be made about a new opportunity here. And I feel like this decision is going to be made today or, or soon. Um, but with the Page of Swords here and the Five of One, Page of Swords in reverse is a release of those delays, but there's still conflict here. There's still conflict here. There's still some sort of conflict here. And the conflict here is that Three of Swords death, the, you need to end this heartache. You need to end the betrayal. Um, a lot of you guys, you're still in this space of trying to balance out past emotions, um, trying to protect yourself from past emotions, but you're not dealing with past people. This is a new opportunity. So I feel like a bad judgment call is being made either about this Queen of Pentacles or this Queen of Pentacles is making a bad judgment call um, about this King of Pentacles or the King of Pentacles is making a bad judgment call again by, about the Queen of Pentacles. Whatever the case, there's not there's a bad judgment call here. Because Four of Cups, someone's stuck in their emotions and they're not moving forward. There's a lack of movement. There's a lack of movement. And maybe this is the past energy because it is in the past. You feel me? And maybe it was a lack of movement in the past, bad judgments in the past. There's this new opportunity here, but someone has to really be honest with what they feel. And I feel like, again, that is a conflict. Just having the opportunity looks like it's a conflict because someone hasn't healed from the past. Someone hasn't healed the, from the past, from things ending in the past. So what guidance do we have? We're going to see what happens further on through this in the extended. What messages or guidance do we have? A new romantic cycle begins. And I definitely see that with the Ace of Cups and the Judgment. Um, expect powerful change. Here. Give me one more about this. Conclusions are within reach. So someone's stepping out of their comfort zone. I definitely see that. But I feel like... <laughs> I feel like it requires putting an end to the past heartbreaks. And that is probably where the stepping out of the comfort zone begins because someone isn't ready to let go of those past emotions because I see it. <laughs> so if you guys want to know more about this reading, you want to see the so again, I'm sorry, my camera cut off. But so again, if you guys would like to see the extended reading to this, just hop on over to my members only section. It's called the wise ones. Um, if you cannot reach it on your phone, because I talked to one of my friends, she said she couldn't get it on the phone. You have to go on the computer, hit the notification bell, click down and you'll see where it says to join. Um, if you guys, again, this is for the extended readings that I've done every day. I'll also be doing a next 48 reading tomorrow, which I'll give you the details of the next 48 hours for like Saturday and Sunday. And I'm also going to do a sneak peek of the Zodiac reads before I release them at the end of this month for those of you that are in the members only section. Um, so this is all I have until next time.